Hey everybody, it's Ultra Loads here, and today this video will show you how to get your WavePad sound editor onto Stereo Mix. Now, the reason why you're probably using WavePad sound editor is because you want a, a background song by a different artist, but because of the copyright, they've rejected your video. Okay, now, um, there there is a tutorial on how to get um, the WavePad sound editor itself, but I'll put the video link in the description on your right. Now, um, okay, uh, we're gonna um, start off by right-clicking on your volume icon and going to recording devices. Now this screen should pop up. Okay. Now the only two choices are line in or microphone. I want you to right click the screen and go to show disabled devices. You'll get CD, audio, and or stereo mix. Now I want you to right click stereo mix and click enable. Now because I've already set stereo mix as my default previously, I won't have to do it again. Sorry about that, those are my sisters. <laughs> Click OK and open your sound editor. Okay, yeah, just a note, my computer doesn't normally go this slow. Usually a lot faster than it normally is. Okay. Now you're gonna click record. Click record. When you um, click OK on this window, it'll take you to this window. Okay. Now stereo mix because it was my my default sound thing thing. Um, <laughs> it'll um, it's already automatically there. So I'm gonna do a sample song. I'm gonna click record. We'll pause the song, and we're going to stop recording. Now you're going to want to exit, and here's the um, here's what we've recorded, um, and this thing here, um, that's just that's just the pause. That's this is the um, time it took for me to activate the song. Now you want to get rid of the pause, okay? Just by simply clicking on it and dragging it to wherever the pause finishes. Okay, there we go. Well, it's sort of, yeah. Now it's got no pauses. There, um, there's your, um, there's what you recorded. Uh, when you play it, it's gonna be sort of low volume, so what you're gonna wanna, so what you're, uh, what you wanna do is, when you click record, set this to 100% and raise the volume of your actual computer. Um, this was another tutorial from Ultra Loads. Please comment, rate, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching. Um, I'll see you on my next video. Okay, correction. You'll see me on my next video. Correction. You'll see my computer screen on the next video.